Hello world, how are you all? I hope you're doing very well, I hope you're having a good day. Uh, today I am in a place called New Radna, which is just over the border in Wales, um, in Powys. And I'm going to walk up to a beautiful waterfall called Water Break Its Neck, which uh, hopefully today will be a complete torrent, absolutely flowing out of control. I want lots of water. It's done nothing but rain and blow a gale for the last two weeks in England. Um, it's almost sunny today. I think the sun might come out in a minute and then it's going to rain, of course. But hey ho, that's England. Um, so yeah, we're going to walk up to it. We're going to do some filming, take some photos of the waterfall. Might even get to fly a drone if the wind drops for a little bit. Maybe. Fingers crossed. Anyway, let's get to it. So up here, this is the way. Look at that. Sunshine. It's about half a mile, I reckon. There's a sign here. Telling us about what's going on. There's lots of walks around here. I don't think we'll be going too far today. I just want to see the waterfall. It's a view back towards England and Kington. So yeah, as I said, about half a mile up here. I could have drove up here, but I think that just fits the object, doesn't it? There is a car park um, if you want if you don't want to uh, walk too far but it's not a hard walk not a hard walk at all and that's it it's only half a mile slightly uphill but nothing too nothing too strenuous and the views well they're all right aren't they it's just a lovely place to come for a walk you can spend all day up here the walks go all the way to the top of the hill the uh, hill's one of the highest points around could even be snow covered at the top in bits of winter. I think it's about 600 meters. I think it's called the Wimble. I may be wrong there. I should have perhaps done some research, but uh, it's certainly a, a lovely place to spend the day. Bring some sandwiches, take your little home, and just take lots of nice photos, maybe a video or two. But this is the way I've come. A little bit of trying to hold the gimbal out whilst walking, not have a heart attack at the same time. Bit of bonus food for the sheep. I hear uh, pine leaves and full of good oils and stuff for animals. Very nice for them. Just might hurt if a tree lands on your head. Okay, we're nearly there now. Here's the other car park. So we've reached the woodland. Oh, Quinningar. I can't fuck it, I can't pronounce that. Quinnigar. Yeah. Apologies to anyone who speaks Welsh. Car park. People. Hello mate, how you doing? Hi. So it's very wet down here. I think it rains here an awful lot, more than most places. And it's almost up the little very steep-sided valley. I would even almost say it's not quite a crevasse. I'm not sure the right word, to be honest. But yeah, there's so much water here that it's almost like a, it's almost like a non-tropical rainforest. It's hard to, hard to explain, really. You see, there's a lot of trees coming down over the stream that goes down the hill. If it wasn't so wet. I'd perhaps walk back down the stream, but. I don't think that's a good option today. Look at the size of these trees. That's a beauty. So the waterfall's up there. Upstream, obviously. But we're just going to have a look. Down here at the stream. So we're going to cross this little bridge. I think they're felling some trees up there. So we won't go up there. Instead, we will look downstream. And that's the tunnel that goes up towards the waterfall. So that's the stream that's coming out of the waterfall. And it obviously meets this one here. And flows back down there where we've come from. It's 
like different trails you can walk around here, I believe. This is just the straight to the point heading to water break its neck. Surely it should be water breaks its neck. Oh well, who cares? That is just awesome. We're not far now. See the path is a little precarious, especially if you like trying to concentrate on four things at once. corner and we should see the waterfall if I've remembered correctly there we go Deep these cliffs are. See why it gets very little light and an awful lot of water just trundles down into this stream. You can probably see the uh, the moss-covered cliffs and everything much better on the way back down. There's a little path up to these tree bits here. I think we're going to get a close-up of those. I think they'll look pretty cool close-up. There are ferns growing. Ferns growing out of the moss. That is so cool. Right, let's try and walk down that without falling over whilst filming at the same time. Here we go. <laughs> oh shit. Trying to keep the camera on the tree. Made it. So we head back down there now, past that gentleman who's got his camera kit as well. I say, it's, it feels like a rainforest at times when you look around. And so back down the path. In search of lunch. Oh, that was close. <laughs> but you ever are in Mid Wales, or you live here and you've never been here, it's just a beautiful place to come and spend a couple of hours. As I said, you could spend all day here if you wanted to go up the hill.
that was Water Breaks' neck. Beautiful place, Mid Wales, one of the nicest spots around here. Uh, I really enjoyed that. If you ever get the chance and you're in this area, do come here because it's fantastic. If you're in the summer, don't expect it to be quite such an impressive waterfall. It can just be a trickle, but it's still a beautiful place to come. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed that. See you later.